Overrides are an important part of troubleshooting and managing a facility. With the right privileges, an operator can evoke overrides in many different ways within FinStack. One of those ways are by commanding a point through a graphic. And as you may notice, as soon as I command the point, its corresponding components within the graphic get highlighted in purple, indicating that they are currently overridden. So imagine you've done a bunch of overrides throughout the day, and now you want to clean up or just see how many points are currently overridden. With the new Overrides app and context-sensitive navigation, you can get a clear overview of what's overridden under any level of your database. To launch the Overrides app, you can open the app launcher and select the Overrides app. You can use the badges within the navigation, or you can use the related bubbles. The app will automatically appear in your mini app sidebar to the right and display all of the overrides related to your current context. In this case, our context is the HU with the one point we just overrode. If I go back to my top level, you can see that the overrides app now shows multiple overrides that are currently active across the database. You may also notice that in the navigation, each override is rolled up into a tiny badge indicating how many overrides are active under that context. As we move down the navigation, you'll notice that the override app updates to show the overrides referenced under that section. Clicking on an individual override will allow you to see what level it's overridden at and also allows you to auto it out. If you go back a step, you also have the option to do batch autos by clicking on the emergency or manual auto options on the top. The auto selected option allows you to select which points you want to auto out. The auto all automatically autos every override under your current context. So now with the overrides app, you can easily find, identify, and clear out your overrides much more efficiently than ever before, which comes in handy when you have a big facility to manage. We hope you've enjoyed this video. If you'd like to see more tutorials and keep up with our latest content, feel free to subscribe to our channel below. Thanks for watching.